Hi everyone, welcome to today's uh, video. So in this video, we're going to show you how we can create gauge charts in Power BI. So gauge chart is one of the charts available in uh, Power BI and it looks like this. So it's like a car gauge where in the lowest, uh, the gauge ranges from the lowest to the highest value. And we get to graph an amount inside of it. So to better show that, let's start, okay? So we have already added the gauge chart and we're going to say create a gauge chart for the order quantity. So I'm going to get my data okay, from a table here that says sales and it contains the order quantity for my sales. So I'm going to drag that number value in the values field and you will see that Power BI creates a gauge chart right away. and it's actually how easy it is to create a gauge chart. You just have to drag a certain field that contains a number into the gauge chart and it's technically almost done. Except that of course, you want to modify some elements of it. So the gauge chart would double the amount, 84,000, and make it as the highest value of the gauge chart. So that's just how it works. So my total orders is 84,000, but a gauge chart should usually show a fraction of it. So we have 168,000 as the uh, maximum value. And let's say we want to change that. Let's say that the quota or the target for this order quantity is 200,000. So how am I going to change the highest value of my gauge chart? So for that, I have to go to the format your visual settings in my Power BI visual. So you have to click on the gauge chart and then click the format your visual option over here. And we see the familiar settings, visual settings, and general settings. General settings being more on settings that are available for any type of chart. While on the other hand, visual settings are settings that are available specific to this kind of visual. So we're going with that, visual settings. And then under the gauge axis, you should see that we have options for minimum, maximum, and the target values. Take note that these options are available in the latest Power BI. So if you don't see these options in your Power BI, you may need to update to the latest version in order for you to see the latest features. So let's say that for the maximum value, I'm going to apply or um, yeah, apply 200,000. So I'm just going to type 200,000. Make sure you don't type just 200. Don't be confused with the letter K there, 200. It should be 200,000. And let's say that the target value is, let's say, 100,000. So the target value will act like a line in your Power BI report. So that is how you can create okay, or modify your gauge chart to have the maximum value and the target value in your visual. And then from here, you can change other settings like colors, and if you want to show the data labels, okay, et cetera. All right. So that's actually it. That's actually how easy to create a gauge chart in Power BI. I hope that helped. And if you have any questions, feel free to use the comment section and I will try to answer as soon as I can. Okay. And if ever this video helped you, we would appreciate a subscribe, a comment, or a like because it really helps us be motivated and create more videos for you. For now, that's it. I'll see you in the next video.